was like I was having like jabbing pains up my leg and just like throbbing, tingling and stuff like that. So bunions aren't as common in younger people, but um, bunions are usually genetic. So usually they start to develop in, in younger people. They're just not as painful and bothersome usually until you get older. A lot of activities I couldn't like run a lot or just play like my family is very like play basketball a lot and I couldn't do any of those sports without having pain. So Jenica had a bunion, but she also had metatarsus adductus. And that's where the first and second metatarsals turn in, which doesn't allow for correction of the bunion. What's unique now though, is we used to have to make all those cuts by hand. So now there's jigs and instruments out there, which we can uh, put onto the foot and help get the correction that we need, but it's reproducible every time to get the correction to correct the second and third metatarsals and then to correct the bunion. So I had my left one done first and then I had my right foot done this past in February. What we did is we did an osteotomy and took a wedge of bone out of her first and out of her second and third metatarsals, which allowed them to correct. And then we were able to fix the bunion to correct that to make it straight. What we found is actually if we can fix bunions sooner before they get arthritis down in them, then we can, can correct it before and we can do different procedures that can preserve the first metatarsal joint where the bunion is at. Also that we found by correcting it back farther in the foot, we found that the correction is able to last longer and the chance of recurrence is much lower. Because my foot, I think, shrunk like a few centimeters after the surgery, so now I can fit into like the shoes that I wanted to fit in more. So I can work now, like I work, and I won't have like near as much pain, obviously, like sometimes people's feet still hurt by the end of the day, but otherwise no like throbbing, no jabbing pains or anything, so I can do everything.